this year's event has been wonderful. We are celebrating 20 years of relaying in Rome, Georgia with the theme of Roaring Twenties. Um, we've had 54 registered teams, over 800 participants, and over 300 survivors registered. So we're really excited about it. We've um, come into the event raising around 60,000, so we've brought in about 10,000 tonight. So um, our goal is 115,000, so when all is said and done, we hope we hit that goal. But uh, for me, uh, my last time calling on here, but I just want to thank you guys for the opportunity uh, to be here with you guys. We really wanted to involve the children in helping to raise funds so they would feel like they were a part of the community. We really focus on character ed traits. Um, we call it being West End. And so our children participated in Penny Wars among our 48 homerooms. And after the Penny War commenced, we had two hat days. And just the three fundraising activities that was simply for children raised $1,392. He's a cancer survivor. So what does it mean to you for Relay for Life? And is this your first year you've attended? No, this is my second year, but it's just nice to have people that can come together that relate. <laughs> It's fun. Is it fun? <laughs> Cancer's not a nice thing though, is it? But you gonna beat it, right? A few years ago, my step papa passed away with cancer, so we're here walking. Almost five. It means a lot. I think he'd be really proud of us. There is hope, and just pray, and God will don't give work. up. Don't give up, and God will do His job. Uh, this year, it is my cousin Maddie. Mor uh, Maddie Sears. Maddie is fighting lymphoma cancer. And so, what does this mean, you know, for you to be out here walking for her, and just seeing the, the the cancer survivors that are out here, and just the stories that you hear? At this point in my life, it means everything. It means everything to know that there's so much hope that everything is going to be perfectly okay. How long have you been fighting with homework? Uh, like, a few months. weeks, a few months, like, months. So what went through your mind when you when you, when you found out the diagnosis? Um, is this actually happening? You know? Well, I'm going to fight, you know? That's right. I'm going to beat it. That's right. That's right. Yeah. Don't, give Don't give up. Don't give up. Yeah. Yeah, it's a cup. I don't know. This guy.